Good morning from a magnificent villa just outside of Rome. You'll have to forgive my disheveled state. I've literally just rolled off a ferry. It's 6.30 in the morning and I barely got a wink of sleep because the bed I was sleeping on was this big. Anyway, final challenge, Orange Crew versus Red Crew. We're navigating our way into the rat run that is the center of Rome. But the catch is we've got to make our way to the Waldorf Astoria Hotel with no sat nav. Doesn't sound like a big deal, but I'm the first one to put my hand up and say that I rely on sat nav pretty much everywhere I go. Haven't read a map in quite a long time. And the challenge is get there first without the help of sat nav. So it's me and Paul in Orange Crew making it to the final base to ultimately check out the brand new McLaren 720S. Let's hit it. Hi. How are you feeling? Tired. Mate, if- I just fell asleep with breakfast. If you look as bad as my hair, you look, you, you're in a bad way. Yeah, so yeah. I went to sleep at the breakfast sleep table. <laughs> at the breakfast table, <laughs> but I actually went to sleep at half three because I was editing last night. Oh, mate, on the ferry as well. Yeah, and then woke up, and then my alarm was set for half five. I stepped off that ferry, it's still a little bit wobbly yeah. this morning. So, anyway, not, not as fresh. you can see my teammate is full of enthusiasm. Yeah. Any strategy, we're just going to follow our nose. Wear my hat and it will guide us. Let's do it. Okay, I'm finally on the road, but I have news. So, because we were first to reach the cars yesterday with all of our items, for more info on that, go and check out Paul and Sam's videos, we get a five minute head start. Oh wow. Yeah. So let's not chat too much, but yeah. we do have a bit of a jump on those guys. So let's, general direction is Rome. Yeah, so let's, head yeah, head for Rome signs, and then it's gonna get tricky from there. Cool. This is my first turning out of the hotel. I know we came in from over there, so, and there was lots of signs back there for Rome, so I guess they head back there. I wouldn't, genuinely, I wouldn't know where to go though. If someone just drops me here, I wouldn't know which way Rome was. Taking the first turning. Hope for the best. I don't know if I'm going to end up in the middle of some agricultural district or if I'm heading the right direction. Also, what is it with the roads in Italy? Considering it's a, a country that's famous for some of the world's best cars, they do not make some of the world's best roads. The road surface, I've never seen anything. Half of it is loose, tarmac, as if they've like tried to fill in the potholes, missed the potholes, and just dumped loose tarmac on the road. The potholes are still there, and you're forever. <laughs> I think this, what I'm actually driving past is a pothole filler. heading in the right general direction about where we're going. The first one is that it's the Waldorf Astoria. The second thing is it's not too far from Vatican City. Now I'm pretty sure the Vatican City is going to be pretty well signposted. So even if we get within the general vicinity there, even if we can't find the hotel directly, there's going to be someone, someone we can ask or just generally drive around and see what's what. Followed the signs for Central, Centro, and then I got and taken a turning upon instinct, and well, my instinct was completely wrong. <laughs> so now, um, 
Yeah, now I don't know. I have no idea where we are. This isn't. This doesn't look like Rome. I can 100% categorically tell you that I am lost. Because unless the Pope has been subject to austerity, this is not Vatican City. Get the feeling we are in the wrong yep. place. <laughs> yep. <laughs> so, I was also thinking, do not let the white lines fool you. They have not repaved this thing since 200 years BC. Yeah. <laughs> the, the road conditions are atrocious. Ha how's your uh, your general nose at guidance? Because uh, I got to be honest, I'm I'm all out, mate. <laughs> I'm. I'm I'm screwed. Yeah, I haven't seen a road sign. No, that makes any sense. All right, I'm gonna take the next left and hope for the best. Oh my God, these roads. It's not now just the potholes and the road surface. It's how tight we are and you can completely and fully understand how every single car has has got a section that doesn't have their pain. Uh, I've taken us down a very disproportionately tight street. <sighs> Drive into Rome, they said. It'll be awesome. We must be miles away because there's no way they'd bring a pack of 20 journalists in supercars down roads like this. Every single car has got a dent. Every single car has got scratches. Every single car has got paint that doesn't belong to theirs on their cars. I'm gonna call James. Hello, mate. Mate, have, have, have you noticed yeah that every single car has got either a dent or paint on their body that isn't theirs. Yeah, I did, didn't need reminding about that. I was just taking in the beautiful architecture. <laughs> this is, this yeah, is... It's not a good point. No, I literally, next person that we see, like, I'm yeah. just, let, let's flag them down and just be like, where is the Waldorf, it's the Waldorf Hotel, isn't it? That's where we're staying? Yeah, it's the Waldorf Astoria. Right. So, okay. yeah, all right, mate. I mean, it is getting a bit daft. Okay. This is the wrong way, for sure. Oh, oh, watch out for big bump, yeah. big bump, big bump. There's a really big bump. Oh. I just saw your... Uh, Jesus, this is uh, steep. <laughs> so, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to put my nose lift up to get down this. Yeah. But I'm not, I've taken the split around this one too many times already, so. That is so steep. We're okay, we're okay, we're okay, we're okay. Awesome. All right, we're getting closer. Yeah. Despite this not being the most, <laughs> the most scenic of views, this is getting a lot more mainstream than it was earlier. Is that, look, is that, just come here, James. <laughs> This is a better view. <laughs> this is a better view. <laughs> <laughs> I've been standing in front of this fence and there's a massive hole there. This is looking pretty awesome. So I wonder where our hotel is in relation to this lot. <laughs> it is just a sprawling uh, network of back streets and tight roads. Uh, we're going to need to ask someone, certainly. But this is boding well. All right, Paul's hopefully asking the local police for guidance. Is it the Waldorf? Waldorf Astoria Hotel. Okay. 
Sì. Sì. Grazie. What's happening? They are? Yeah. Awesome. This is a great way to end it. <laughs> Paul's gone and found us a police escort to the hotel. Hold on. Paul, where have your mates gone? <laughs> now we might also need to look for a crane. Sounds random, I know, but McLaren are famous for putting cars on top of hotels when they launch new cars. And they always close down the area, wheel in a massive crane, and they, they crane in a car to put on the rooftop. So if we can find a crane, because, I mean, I know that sounds daft, but honestly, there are not too many cranes in the area. What was that? Villa Miani? No, not us. This looks like a big hotel. And it's the first big hotel I've seen. What is this? What is this? What is this? I'm just gonna pull in and hope for the best. There's no sign on it. Could be a government building for all I know. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> but I'm coming in anyway. Even a government building. We I didn't even know if this was like the hotel. Minutes. Oh. Yeah. Red crew is the best. Red crew is the best. <laughs> Which route did you take? I, I mean, I do not know. Well, Main a, Street. A route. Main route. We did pretty did well. Did you see any sights and sounds? We asked somebody. We didn't. We didn't see anything. We asked the police, and they were like, Paul was like, "Will you uh, take us to the hotel?" And he was like, "See, we just drove off." <laughs> <laughs> we were like, "Cool. Amazing. Thanks for that." Uh, oh, well done, mate. Fair Thank enough. Much. Thank you. We all. went and down the some good news is horrific we're at the hotel streets. Now. This is the hotel anyway. <laughs> Time to go to sleep. Game finally. over. Okay. They're there. James, I haven't seen you yet. Bro, you, you we, sorted it. We you absolutely it nailed it. Well done. I'm afraid well done. that uh, yeah. we had a pretty intense uh, oh, backstreet rat run. It's crazy. Give you guys an idea. But honestly, it has been good. It has been awesome. It's been it's really such just a good consoling way. his orange it's been heart. Such a good week. It has you been. Don't a, need that it has been event, man. Like, this cost me eight euros. Despite us, get how long mm. after you arrived did we arrive? Eleven minutes. Eleven yeah, minutes. Yeah, oh, yeah, wow. start smashed. Yeah, oh, wow. even with a police escort and a five-minute head start. Yeah, yeah, so we yeah, failed, failed yeah, largely. Um, we did see some like interesting back streets. Yeah, yeah. yeah. as you've yeah. seen, it is a, a warren. It's just amazing. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's yeah. Super really tight and, and crazy. But well done. Thank you very Congratulations, much. Congratulations, guys. Thank, thank you so much. Awesome. Thank Thanks you. for taking part. There's always yeah. Yeah, it's for taking part. <laughs> the counts. That counts yeah. guys. Um, anyway, we are in Rome finally, and uh, tomorrow we're going to be driving the new McLaren 720S, which is ultimately why we're here. So, yeah. Uh, well, stay tuned. Road trip. It is. Under embargo until next week. Yeah, uh, yeah, middle of next week. Middle of next week, but no doubt there'll be photos on Instagram. So check mm. on everyone's accounts. As always, thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. See Bye -bye. Ciao.